the driveway, go get some stuff done. There's my town over there. Archetypes. Just driving down the driveway. Go see my town. Do some groceries. Just love these big open skies. I am going to my favorite coffee shop on Alma Street. This is Alma Street. It's quite lovely. It is 94 Take the Cake. It's a very cute little coffee shop. There's some beautiful houses here on Alma Street. And the funny thing is... <laughs> okay, so here's the funny thing, right? My Jeep has one of those keys where you push the button. You don't actually have to put the key in. So for some reason, I cannot find my keys. They're in my car somewhere. But you know what? It's Okotoks. It's Canada. So what do I do? I just leave my car unlocked. I go in. I have coffee for an hour with a friend. And all my stuff is still here. Unfortunately, it's a lot of stuff. Let's see? <laughs> Kid stuff, mail. Oh, gosh. I left my wallet and my sunglasses and my glasses lying right here. I probably shouldn't do that. I'm not saying you should do it. I'm just saying I did it and everything's fine. <laughs> so this is where I have to pause for a moment just to share some fun Canadian facts. There is a town in Manitoba called Churchill and in Churchill there are a great deal of polar bears. So it is actually a city bylaw that you are required to leave your car unlocked. Should anyone come into uh, contact or be pursued by a polar bear, they have somewhere to escape to. They also actually require you to leave your houses unlocked so that people could escape the polar bears there as well. They've actually found a way to live peacefully with the polar bears, I believe. I have put some articles and links down below this video if you are curious to learn more about the unlocked cars, houses, and polar bears. So I'm heading into Sobeys just to do some groceries today. It's a beautiful day. There's snow on the ground, but it's a nice crisp, I think one or two degrees. So I am just, so I'm just walking around in my cardigan, heading into Sobeys. I feel like Sobeys reminds me a bit of pick and pay in South Africa. Maybe a little bit of the spas as well. Ooh, chocolate biscuits. Oh my gosh, look at these. Star Wars Christmas cookies. Mmm, fun. You gotta love the Canadian ice creams. They look like maple leaves. And the Canadian maple, eh? <laughs> oh man, so many choices. So, my daughter loves ice cream sandwiches, so does my mom. But now, which ones? There are so many choices. How do you decide? Just driving up my driveway on this beautiful winter's day. The sky is gorgeous. The snow is somewhat melted. You can actually see the driveway. And I've just got back from some grocery shopping before I sit down for some lunch, feed my daughter. She has a day of school today and start building more businesses and creating more stuff to help people. That is what I love to do. So welcome to my home.